What's up? Uh, what's up? Hey, I'm Adam. Welcome to my video. Spent most of the day packing. All right, we got a flight tomorrow morning pretty early, but OSW has a driver appreciation night. Half race driving. A lot of my friends are coming out to drive, and uh, yeah, it's a night session, so it's like 7 p.m. till midnight. Got a couple eight class sessions, so we're just gonna go hang out and do some skids, bro. Okay, bye. See you there. Ring, ring. <laughs> Got you. I will say it is kind of surprising how dailyable this car is at 750 wheel horsepower. It's very drivable, other than the clutch being a little weird. It sounds so good through this alley. Cops been trying to race me all night. I'm trying to give them the sauce, but I got a car in front of me. It's so weird pulling up on the track this late at night without the truck or trailer, because obviously Tommy brought it here. That way I could spend some more time packing. It's just weird, it seems so dead. Pulling up in the BMW too is throwing me off. I will when Adam shaves his mustache. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, All right, we're gonna take out to Tommy's new Johnny's on here. Tommy, you got a story behind these blitz. Let's hear it. The story is, is that I bought these things like four, three years ago, four years ago. They just sat. They were supposed to go on my Teal Esther team and never got around to it. So now finally, and I'm kind of glad that it, like, it, everything just worked out because they fit perfect. Whoa, 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 whoa. How did you get the truck and trailer here and your car here? Um, that's a move. That's a, that's just that's a LZ move right there. That's just what I do. I've been I'm learning from the best. Look at this thing. So sick. The only thing that looks better than these new Blitz are this man's haircut. Look at him eating the chips. Hey, Alberto. Got him. So humid out that everything is just wet. So I'm just gonna give Tommy the outside cam and have him get some outside shots. And then I'll play around with some GoPro stuff on the next session. fun running with Alan. It's like been a minute since we've been able to have our cars together. It's kind of interesting since both cars make similar horsepower and torque but are so different because his car is an LS and mine's an SR. Um, it was really fun running with him though. I can't get over how much I can outlap that car. It's uh, it's with a good thing and a bad thing that I don't have a oil temp gauge because they're probably getting kind of hot. But we're good. We're good. I'm jinxing myself right now. I probably shouldn't be saying that.
foggy out. It's gonna be hard for you guys to tell. I think the GoPro footage was probably garbage, but it was just getting to the point where I just, I was driving well, but I felt like it was just asking for something to happen, and I made the call that I was just gonna chill for the rest of the night. Because with the fog, I just, I don't feel comfortable following someone really close, and if I can't really drive my hardest, I'd rather not be out there risking the car and putting wear and stuff on it, because um, it's just sketchy. Uh, I, with how much grip the car has now, now, like I've been abusing the crap out of the clutch just to keep it in boost and stuff, which you kind of have to do. So I think I'm going to be preventative too and uh, order some new um, discs for my twin discs. That way when the clutch does go, we're ready to just bang a new one right in. All the frosty white snowmobiles just frosting it up. Look at this thing. It's so cool. Hey, it's me again. We made it back home safe. 12.55 a.m. it is. Going to bed soon is what I must do. Still got packing to do, somehow. I feel like you give me two days to pack, it'll take me two days to pack. You give me 30 minutes to pack, it'll take me 30 minutes to pack. This is what I've learned. That's why going on last minute trips actually helped me in this situation. But anyway, uh, I know tonight was a rather short video. Um, I wasn't really at the track as long as I anticipated and I kind of wasted more of the day than I thought I would doing like packing stuff. And uh, anyway. We are going to Connecticut to go hang out with my friends and have a just chill rest of the year. So, rest of the year, it's almost the end of the year, huh? We'll be up there for a couple days. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do content-wise. I'm really, really hoping it will snow because I really wanna drive the Evo in the snow. I got some snow tires and wheels for it, so that thing is gonna go into winter mode and it's gonna be sick. Um, also, I'll keep you guys updated in regards to details on the giveaway. Uh, I have to get like the legal stuff sorted and then I can give you guys the details and explain to you how it's going to work and everything. But we do have a sale going on right now on the LZMFG store, so if you want to check that out, there is a link in the description. It's this week only. This week end only. But, uh, gonna go to bed now, and by that I mean keep packing and get the house sorted so I can come back to a somewhat sorted house. It's always nice to do that, so. Thank you guys for watching, I appreciate you, and I hope you enjoyed my video. The footage came out way better than I thought. Probably some of my favorite drift event footage that I've gotten. For whatever reason, that in-car GoPro looks so rad, and I had one on the hood where the footage didn't really come out that nice, but using for the turbo noise was sick. So, anyway, that's how I did that. That's how I did that. Okay, I had to give the seven-string back, so no seven-string guitar playing tonight. Goodbye. Okay,